we're going to be looking here at the adrenal glands. Adrenal means next to the kidney, which is where these ductless glands are located, one on each side of the body. Like the pituitary gland, the adrenal gland consists of two parts with different developmental origins. But rather than being separated into anterior and posterior, the adrenal gland is separated into the adrenal medulla on the inside and the adrenal cortex on the outside. These two parts produce different families of hormones with different functions. There are three subdivisions to the adrenal cortex. The inner part is the zona reticularis, the middle zone is the zona fasciculata, and the outer zone is the zona glomerulosa. Each produces a different type of steroid hormone, although they are all related. The term corticosteroid is sometimes used to refer to the most important hormones coming from the adrenal cortex, which are those from the outer two layers. Because these are typical steroid hormones, they are fat-soluble, travel in the blood bound to carrier proteins, pass through cell membranes, and activate intracellular receptors with the effect of changing patterns of gene expression. The hormones from the adrenal cortex have widespread and long-term effects all around the body.